Chattanooga, a local business owner, has a lot to say after the Hamilton County Health Department announced a possible COVID-19 exposure at her shop. Channel 3's Joy Dukes joins us live with more from the Ice Cream Show. Joy? Yeah, David, Linda Curtis says that one of her employees tested for COVID-19 a few weeks ago and she thought her results were negative. So she went ahead and came into work well, due to some confusion with her test results. That employee and several others will have to wait until they get tested again before they can return. Ice cream show owner Linda Curtis says she's doing everything she can to keep the ice cream cones coming at her business in downtown Chattanooga after having to close earlier this year. COVID has hit small businesses the worst. I need the income. I don't have any other source of income. That includes following CDC, state, and local guidelines for COVID-19 to keep employees and customers safe. We do check everybody's temperature when they come in and um, make sure that they haven't been, um, you know, exposed to somebody. But she had no choice but to close for part of the day on Monday after the Hamilton County Health Department announced a possible exposure at several businesses, including her ice cream shop, where an employee tested positive. She actually doesn't have any um, symptoms, and um, I won't have her come back to work until the 14 days or whatever is up. But Curtis says that employee only came into work because she thought results showed she tested negative for the virus. Her mom actually looked online and it was negative and so she came to work. But then the health department called her later that evening and said that she had tested positive. We reached out to the Hamilton County Health Department to see if there could have been an error in the testing process and whether it's happened before. We're still waiting to hear back. She had gotten online and thought the test result was negative, and so she felt confident that she was okay to come to work. Well, the ice cream show is back open after they closed partially on Monday to do a very deep clean of the facility. And for now, those four employees will be at home until they receive a negative test result. For now, live in downtown Chattanooga, I'm Joy Dukes, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. Thank you, Joy.